My name is Julie bliss Mullen, co-founder and CEO of Aclarity, an inventor in the Lemelson MIT Student Prize Competition. The devastating water crisis in Flint, Michigan left 60% of society with a lack of trust in U.S. drinking water. And because of this, 80 million homes are looking for a solution to protect their families from growing water quality issues. I founded Aclarity two years ago with the passion and commitment to provide sustainable water solutions through invention and commercialization by developing a patent-pending electrochemical water purification technology that will ensure clean water for families globally. This device is the first decentralized mini water treatment plant for homes to be installed where the water enters the house, ensuring clean water throughout. Here's how it works. Water passes through the device where reactions take place between the anode and the cathode. Fast reacting chemicals are generated, which disinfect bacteria and viruses, destroy harmful toxins, and remove metals from water while normalizing pH. All this is done with no brine to manage, no water wasted, or filters to replace, and uses small amounts of electricity equivalent to an LED light bulb, easily powered with renewable sources such as solar. When you think of water treatment solutions, you usually think of something like a Brita filter or maybe a reverse osmosis system that has a membrane. What's different about our technology is that we actually destroy contaminants. We use electricity to zap a contaminant out, so it's a chemical change as opposed to a physical change. We're changing water purification, changing the paradigm of water purification. Because the technology is so scalable, there's many different applications. It's not just a, a home solution. This can be scaled all the way up to a municipal size. My primary focus has been in the residential water treatment market. So we're working with a residential leader to help us commercialize a product just like this. This is something that a homeowner doesn't have right now. And if we go all the way up the chain to a municipal system, they're still adding chlorine, they're still doing all of the filtration that's necessary. This is going to change all that.